To use the Kahuna app, you'll first need to link your mobile device to your current Kahuna account. You can do this by entering in your email address, the one associated with your kahunaonline.com account, on this login page. Next, tap the Validate User button. Then, tap the Generate Token button, which will send an email to the address you've just provided with a long alphanumeric token in it. Now log in to kahunaonline.com. In the left side menu, click on Admin Functions, then Company, and finally on Device Management. Here you will see your device, and currently listed as not active. Activating your device from this page is a two step process. The first step is turning the activation on, while the second step is setting the device pin. The first step can be completed in two different ways. You can either check the box in the far left column next to your device, click on the Page Actions button, select Activate Device Association from the drop-down menu that appears, and then click OK on the confirmation window. Or you can click on the check mark in the far right column. To complete the second step of the activation process, you must click on the padlock symbol in the far right column. The Set Device Pin window will appear. First, copy the token you received in your email and paste it into this token field. Next, create a pin that is at least 4 characters long. Confirm the pin by retyping it and then click on the Save Changes button. Returning to the app, tap the Continue button. When the login screen appears, enter your newly created PIN and then tap Login. Keep in mind that you will need to enter this PIN again for future logins on the app. By tapping the connectivity icon, you can see the Kahuna Mobile app can operate in three connectivity modes. Wi-Fi only mode allows transfer of data to and from the phone only when your device is connected to Wi-Fi. Mobile data mode allows transfer of data to and from the phone using the device's mobile data plan. However, it will still use Wi-Fi instead of the data plan if your device is connected to Wi-Fi. Offline mode is designed for completely disconnected environments. Before entering into offline mode, you must first connect your device to Wi-Fi so you can synchronize offline users and ensure you have the latest data on your device. Once you have established a Wi-Fi connection on your device, tap Offline Mode. You will automatically be prompted to synchronize offline users. Tap the OK button to continue. Tap the Team icon at the bottom of the screen to view your My Team page. Here you will see the list of all your direct reports as well as all of the people that you can assess. You can filter this list by tapping the Toggle Details icon and then selecting one of the filter options. Tap on an individual's name to bring up their personal profile. Each competency assigned to the employee is sorted into one of these colored blocks depending on what the status of the competency currently is. Simply tap on one of the colored blocks to view the list of all the assigned competencies within that status category. To perform a new assessment, tap on the desired competency. To begin with, the assessment form will be fully collapsed. 
Tap each red bar to expand the competency levels and see the detailed elements within them. Check all the desired elements that apply to your assessment and add comments to each element as needed by expanding the element. You may choose to set a date that the assessment was performed within the Assessment Date section. If you do not choose a date, the current date will automatically be selected for you. If there are learning resources associated with this competency, you can view them within the Learning Resources section. Once you are satisfied with the assessment, tap the Complete Assessment button to submit it. If you are in Wi-Fi only mode or mobile data mode, the assessment is automatically sent to the kahunaonline.com website. If you are operating in offline mode, the assessment data is stored locally on your device in a pending sync status category. It will remain there until it is uploaded to the website, which will automatically happen once you switch to a working connected mode. Thanks for watching the Kahuna mobile app tutorial.